Hello everybody, um, I'm going to explain to you how to connect your panel to the Wi-Fi EWILink app uh, if it doesn't want to connect the traditional way. So you switch your panel on and this light will start blinking. That means that the Wi-Fi unit is working. Okay. You press and hold your black button like it was instructing you to do the first time round until you get a three blink. Now the three blink is for the traditional linking. If we want to do it the IT via Wi-Fi, it's a different way. So you press it and hold it for another five seconds, more or less, and it will continuously fast blink. See, like that. Now it means that the Wi-Fi switch is setting, sending out a signal. So once it does that, you go to your app, eWeLink app, and you open it up like this in the screen. You go on to plus sign. You don't do anything here. You go here where it says compatible pairing mode AP. You press on that. It gives you this. Okay. You go out of EWI link and you go to your Wi-Fi setting. Under Wi-Fi settings, IT will come up. That is your panel. You click on it. It asks you for a password. The password is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Join. You'll see that it would connect to the panel like that. Okay, like you would connect to normal Wi Fi. You go out, you go back to your EWILink app, and now on the screen, you go next. There it shows you your Wi-Fi and the password, your own Wi-Fi. That's what needs to be shown there. You go next. Now it recognizes the device immediately. And it will take about 20 seconds or so for it to register. Once it's registered, it will go to the next screen where it would ask you to name this device. There, it's almost done. There. So now... You name the device. I'm going to call my device Office. Okay, Office 1. You go complete. Okay, it says the device is connecting to Wi Fi. It might take a few minutes. Okay, say so got it. It will show like this, but this light will now be on, which means that it's now connected to a Wi Fi model. So now, if you go on to this office one, it's now working. See? On, and the light goes on. Off, and the light goes off. So that will connect your, if you now, you can suit your schedules, your timers, whatever you want to do. But I want to show you a, another trick. So if you go onto the panel site, so on the landing site, you go into this device that you've registered. You click on the right hand side, on the three little dots. It gives you setting. You go to setting. You'll see power on state is defaulted to off. You go change that. You put that on to on. There. Done. You go out. It will say there that your it's got a firmware that can be upgraded. You can always upgrade as it comes. Then your panel is connected. What this will do now for you is that... If you switch your panel off manually and you switch it on, it will switch on without Wi-Fi. So even if you're not connected to Wi-Fi, your panel will switch on and this will be a normal on-off operation. If your panel, if you set your schedule, your schedule will put your panel on and off as per the required times as what you've set up on your eWeeLink app. I hope this helps and if you have any further queries, please don't hesitate to contact us. Thanks. Bye.